Hello my lovelies and welcome to my channel and I thought I would just do a little bit of a haul video for you. So the thing she got me was from Bath and Body Works. I love my candles and she got these on sale. I think these were $10 instead of like the 20 They're more summery smells but that's perfect for me. So it's Harlequin. Come away honey. <laughs> this one is the water lem Watermelon Lemonade. That's just, it's absolutely gorgeous. I second candle, and this is the Mango Coconut Cooler. I hope they're focusing in. Again, it's the three. Oh my god. Oh, that is lovely. It's the three wick one again. Um, mango's peeled and diced, fresh coconut milk. It is. It's mango on the top, if you know what I mean, and then you can really get the coconut coming through. So that's, she's got those candles to a perfect tea for me. Perfect. And then she got me a couple of the hand soaps. Uh, this is the Wild Mango Mojito Gentle Foaming Hand Soap. So this is the foaming one. Let's have a whiff at this. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, <laughs> that would be a lot stronger than the candle now, I must admit, but maybe it's the coconut that's cutting through. And then the next one is a deep cleansing hand soap. Copacabana coconut. She knows I like my fruity scents. Oh, that's lovely. It's not too coconutty. I'm sure those will be lovely. I saw this appear in the box I was my heart started to pound a bit <laughs> and she get she did god love her she got me the brow ways in chocolate I think I said to her chocolate or soft brown oh it's a lot thinner and smaller than I had thought so yeah it just has the little crayon on the bottom It's quite a cool tone brown, nearly. It's quite a hard consistency. I thought it would be a softer consistency for some reason, but I'm very pleased with that. And then obviously the spoolie on this side. Oh, Harlequin's just ran into the camera. <laughs> so I am chuffed with that. There's another thing I didn't bring out of the box. Okay, on to the other stuff. She got me the CoverGirl Clump Crusher in black, the mascara. I've heard absolutely wonderful things about this, so I am really excited to try that. She got me the, but I'll not be able to open this. The Sonia Kashuk, one of the lip crayons um in Dahlia it looks to be a like a quite a deep berry red oh it's very deep actually well no I must admit it looks lighter in the packaging than the swatch but that's it there it's lovely that'll be nice next winter now so it will without a doubt and then she got me the covergirl bombshell intensity liner in chocolate kiss this is a felt tip liner Oh, it's so cute, the packaging. That's uh, hard to get open there. And that's it. It's a very, very fine little nib, which is perfect. Oh, it's lovely and it's very pigmented. It's just this bottom one here. Um, and it went on nice. So I will definitely be giving 
that a try. So Nutashik product. It's a lip and cheek balm. These are quite hard to open. <laughs> in the colour Enchanted 101. And it's a, it's a pink. I love the packaging of these. It, it actually reminds me of it. And now the sort of the feel of the packaging. Ooh. No, I didn't expect that. It's, it's came out in a little, like a Dover applicator. Isn't that lovely? It's not crazy pigmented, but that would be nice just for a wee wash of colour. It's that one there. That's lovely. So it's, that's definitely something I'm looking forward to. She then got me, this is something I have been looking for and I'm not, I haven't seen this one in any of my boots. It's the Maybelline, the Colour Tattoo Studio, the Tough, tough as Taupe. I think these are great just for a wee, a wee base, so isn't that lovely? Yeah, that's just a perfect colour if you want to slap that on on a day that you're really not feeling up to doing a lot of makeup and just blending it out slightly. That's lovely. Okay, what's next? Yes, the I have seen this. It's the Maybelline, it's the, is it the Colour Bam? Colour, Colour Sensation in Wild, Wild Rose. This is lovely. This is one of the ones that I had chose. Isn't that lovely? I'm really not, I'll swatch it there, that'll be easier. It's lovely. It's, um pinky red eh? but it's a it's a nice pinky red it's not too much that'll be lovely in the summer and then she got me let's see if i can open this it's a quad from cover girl it's a nude quad is there an actual name for it it's the eye enhancers fard accent maybe that isn't even the right thing smoky naked smoky nudes smoky naked and it's just four little colours they all seem pretty matte with one of the little spongy applicators so those are nice that could be really nice for just a daytime or you could darken it up for the night time she also got me the colour elixirs the Maybelline colour elixirs this is the one uh hibiscus have and we can get this here but this is one of the ones that I'd hemmed and had about for a while, um, but I thought, why not? So yeah, it's that, it's a beautiful bright pink, and these are so soft. You can see a real colour <laughs> going on, pinks and reds. And the e.l.f. brushes are getting really good reviews, so I asked her to bring me a couple. I basically gave her a list and said, get whatever you can. So she got me the Defining Eye Brush. It's quite soft. Um, it's not overly densely packed. So I just wanted something a bit smaller for placing colour into the crease. So yeah, another thing Christine got me was the Sonia Kashuk, the Tinted Brow Gel. Now this only comes in one shade. Um, I really didn't know whether to get the Brow Wiz, the Anastasia Brow Wiz or their Tinted Brow Gel, so I thought I would try this. Um, looking at it, I think it's going to be pretty grey. It's your sort of bog standard mascara wand. It looks actually quite big. The colour itself is quite grey, but maybe with powder underneath it might work. Um so the last 
The last couple of things, yeah, I got her to get me the AOS. I had asked her just to pick me up a couple. Um, I wasn't really too concerned on like flavours and stuff. I thought the mint and the strawberry would be nice. So in the end up she got me a pack of four and it was sweet mint, summer fruit, strawberry sorbet and blueberry acai. This is the, the strawberry one. They're so little, it's like a wee rubbery ball. Oh no, it's the sorbet. I won't put it on because I've got lipstick, but they're lovely. I've heard so much about these and I think these are a real like YouTuber blogger thing. So I really had to get those. And then finally, oh no, actually two things left. She got me some of the pocket bag from Bath and Body Works. So she got me the crisp apples, the sweet pea and the margarita. <laughs> and the last thing, oh, uh, I spied this on the Target website. It's just a little Sonia Kashuk bag. Basically it opens out and it has two little, you know, clear pouches. So I thought that would be handy. I might use that for my everyday makeup and throw it into my handbag. So yeah, that is what Christine got me. Christine, thank you so much for everything that you got me. Um, I am over the moon by it all. It's a good job you're not coming home from Canada and going back to Canada every couple of months because my bank balance couldn't cope, it, cope with it. I'm now going to go and light the watermelon lemonade, I think, and I will let you all know what everything is like. If you follow me on Twitter and Instagram, um, I will keep everybody up to date on everything. I will be doing a blog post on a few of these items. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, these videos, as I say, are still quite new to me. Everything's still working itself out with editing and everything like that. But I'm really enjoying it and the feedback I'm getting is really good. So yeah, thank you. Bye.